Today's video is sponsored by Tupelo Designs LLC where U.S. shipping is always free with no minimum purchase and international shipping is discounted. They are also home of the daily deals so be sure to check that out. I'll be making a friend card with this Alta New stamp set and it's called Free Form Greenery and I will be using Memento Tuxedo Black Ink and I have a white card panel that is uh, four, four inches by five and a quarter and I'm putting uh, the elements, the leaves um, where I want them and then I'm stamping them out and that's what's great about this Stamp Perfect tool is I can get perfect placement and I, I sometimes have to turn the card stock but that's okay and I just keep going until I fill up that uh, panel and again you know the Stamp Perfect tool is fantastic I recommend it for any stamper uh, beginner or advanced I like it that much and then once I have that all finished I'm going to take it out of my Stamp Perfect tool my Hampton Arts Stamp Perfect tool and I'm going to color it with Faber-Castell Polychromos colored pencils and I'm just coloring with uh, two different shades of green for each of the leaves and I'm trying to make this look like a spring type card you know because today was the first day of spring so I didn't want to make it a fall type card so each leaf is going to be different greens two different greens the darkest on the outside and lightest in the middle and then I'm going to show you how I blend these color pencils with Gamasol or uh, odorless mineral spirits and then uh, for those berries there I'm using pink well I think they're berries I'm not quite sure <laughs> and for that bud there I'm using two shades of purple and that is my Gamasol or odorless mineral spirits and that's a blending stump and I'm dipping it in the Gamasol and then I'm rubbing it over the colored pencil and it's blending it very nicely so I really didn't have to do any shading or anything like that but once it's done it's gonna look fantastic and I'll show you the finished result but I just keep blending each of the elements that I colored and then um, can't forget those berries and I, I dip it quite quite uh, frequently just so the blending tool stays damp and that's it it's finished it, it almost looks like it's colored with marker or it's painted and this is a MFT die uh, a dynamics die and it's called friend and I'm gonna put that on that card front and I'm gonna uh, attach it with some washi tape so it doesn't move and then once it's die cut out I use some liquid adhesive and I put it on a five and a half by four and a quarter black cardstock panel and I just glued it on there and then I'm putting some double stick tape on my card base and that's a standard A2 size card base and once I get that all done I put the the card front right onto the card base and that's it it is finished I will have all the links to all the products I use down below and be sure to check out Tupelo Designs LLC's Facebook group they have a lot of fun challenges going on over there and again, I will link that down below. Thanks for watching. Bye.